What's up everybody? Welcome back to Exotic Astrology again and today we shall discuss on why we should not gossip. <laughs> if you are new to the channel then please subscribe to it for daily updates on spirituality, positivity and astrological placements. And if you like this video then click the thumbs up at the end of course. <laughs> so there you go. Before I begin, as I say, God is there with you all the time. Just look to him and he will be there and he will help you overcome gossips. So basically, what is gossip? Gossip is like, there's this uh, story once my Guru Maharaj said. So I want to s share that. <laughs> I don't know, should I share this openly in YouTube? But okay, why not? So what happened was, once there was a person, he uh, he decided, he, ha he was staying in a group where there was a lot of gossip going on. All right. <laughs> I seriously don't know, should I still share it? Okay. So there was this, uh, <laughs> there was this uh, group where there was a lot of gossip going on. This is an imaginary story. This, uh, this is not true actually, but my Guru Maharaj just uh, manufactured it and he said, he heard it from somewhere. <laughs> so he told me. So what happened? There was a big group and a lot of people. They were, what, what they were doing is, they were bitching about each other, gossiping. Okay, he did this. He's having an affair with this girl. She's having an affair with that boy. And then, oh, he's like this, she's like that. No. It's like the crab mentality, trying to pull everybody down. So therefore, what happened is, there was one fellow, <laughs> he got very much frustrated. He was so disgusted. He was like, my God, I can't stay here. So all this negativity, all this garbage, all this poison, whoever is doing what, just, I'm done with all this. So then what happened? He decided to, teach them a lesson so what he did next day morning <laughs> he went to answer the call of nature and then what happened when he was cleaning his bowels he collected his waste <laughs> in a packet in a bowl and he stored it his human waste his auspicious remnants <laughs> Higher version of remnants, I would say. And then what he did? Next day, uh, sorry, that day evening itself, he went to everybody's door and he knocked. Tuck, tuck, tuck. And then that person came out and asked, I have something with me. Do you want to share? <laughs> and then what happened? This fellow opened that bowl where he had kept his stool and he said this is what I have to say and this person was like oh my god <laughs> seriously have you lost it man <laughs> and he just banged that door and he said just get out of here I don't want to see you and then he did this with every person in the room in that uh, building and then these people started messaging each other. Now, oh, this guy has done this, uh, this, uh, this stupid, this stupid act of his has given so much disgrace to our society. So then, what happened? This guy he came down and he started sitting in the center of the place where all these people were assembled of that building, and then everybody started coming to him one by one, and then said, "Oh my God, how could you do like this?" I mean, are you insane that <laughs> you are doing this? <laughs> then he said, I have a purpose behind doing this. Because gossip in scriptures is compared to stool. Who gossips? Only a person who has no, who has so much time left that he has nothing to do in this world. Only that person gossips. Yes, do you understand? <laughs> So this person said, you are already uh, touching stool every morning with your mouth. You are licking it, you are s drinking it. 
you are smelling it you are enjoying it in fact enjoying gossip is like enjoying stool yes 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 it is <laughs> because you are fueling the negativity inside that is why you see people need a lot of spice these days when they are not having a spiritual wisdom spiritual light spiritual content spiritual fulfillment then what happens is they will uh suck they will try to suck the juice from all these topics okay what's going on in the internet what's going on in the film industry the film industry is so special right we are wasting money for people who don't even know us <laughs> cricketers uh, sorry the film stars they hardly know who we are they don't know if you think they know you maybe they or maybe they don't but it's highly likely that they don't know you yes because they keep meeting thousands of people every day and you are just wasting your valuable time to help them get more money now i'm not saying that's a bad profession what i'm saying is choose your time carefully choose where to invest your time your energy because the time is the only thing that you have in this world and then this fellow he said okay so if you are disgusted with me sharing my pot of stool with you then please do not gossip from tomorrow and then the people were astonished they said yes you are right the only thing we are doing is we are discussing the faults of each other so what happens is when you gossip your wherever your uh, mercury is placed that house is destroyed I repeat wherever your mercury is mercury will be somewhere right everybody will have a mercury that house is destroyed if your mercury is in the 7th house and you are gossiping you will have a, a separation from your spouse take it i have seen people <laughs> do not gossip it's very dangerous if it's in the 9th house and you are gossiping you will have fights with your guru your guru will say i can't accept you anymore please leave and you will say oh do hell with your knowledge i will go to some other guru then you go to another guru and the same thing happens if mercury is in the ninth house i am saying if mercury is in the lagna your whole life gets destroyed please do not do this but then the question is how to get rid of gossip so the first step is getting rid of those people who keep gossiping all the time because a person who gossips about somebody to you the next moment will go and gossip about you to somebody else should i repeat the person who gossips with you about somebody will go and gossip about you to somebody else so if you are enjoying that gossip okay this person is doing this this person is doing that oh maybe it's like this maybe it's like that all those garbage if you are sucking that means you are sucking the garbage with that person because the crow always searches for garbage <laughs> but the swan the hans will always search for water and milk so always try to find good so that's the first step try to delineate yourself from those people who always keep gossiping second is try to find the company of those people who are motivated and positive and who are spiritual in nature that is the second most important step you need to do and third is you have to reenvision your entire life accordingly so that you do not feed on the subtle gossips also subtle gossips means seeing in uh, seeing things like who which movie star is having an affair with whom so how in the universe is that going to affect you if you think you are in an illusion <laughs> recently i was seeing okay this bollywood star they had an they are having an affair with this person so another bollywood star and that video has some 4 million likes so you now you understand how jobless people are now you understand what it means when people say i don't have time for spirituality i don't have time for god you always have time the only thing is you prioritize into wrong places you are so foolish that you don't know where to spend your time and because of that you end up wasting it you are so grossly foolish if you do that gossiping around all right so please stay away from those people second is associate yourself with those people who 
talk of positive things who talk of spiritual topics not necessarily very highly spiritual but at least they should have positive things to share with you associate with yourself with them and third is take care of your overall life don't bring negativity through youtube or through tv through media do not do that because that will ultimately hamper your first and second uh, thing which you are doing if you are seeing nonsense in youtube and then if you uh, delineate yourself from the people physically who are gossiping you will still end up gossiping i know people so do not destroy yourself please because then what happens your mercury is destroyed all right and it will rule two houses and it will sit somewhere so three houses of your horoscope is getting destroyed congratulations <laughs> and then later people call me and say oh i am having scandal i don't know how this thing spread it's karma basically bang on <laughs> you were insulting somebody now somebody is insulting you in this life and then if you say this they will say no 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 i am very good person i never gossip about anybody you may do it you may not do it this in this life but in past and previous lifetimes you have done it otherwise it doesn't happen it simply doesn't happen i have seen <laughs> all right so please take care of yourself do not destroy yourself with gossip and put yourself in the company of good people who motivate you to do good things in life who talk of ideas of how to change things how to change the world how to change yourself internally using spirituality or at least even without spirituality that's not very feasible in the long run but even even if the person is an atheist or he is a skeptic or agnostic if he is talking of positive things go and associate with him all right that is it from my side if you want a consultation then approach me in my website below and that's it i will end this video and if you have not subscribed to it then please subscribe to it and hit the thumbs up all right protect yourself from the poison until next time bye bye see you